Hello guys and welcome to a brand new video. Today I'm here with a Honkai Impact trailer reaction. This has come out very recently and I'm pretty excited to check this out. This is called Forever Straight True to Yourself Honkai Impact 3rd S rank Battlesuit Palatinus Equinox trailer. Now <clears throat> this like you know like i have to say um i usually do not react to these trailers uh you know like i usually react to the uh, animations short animations i never reacted to the trailers before but this time i'm doing this because i i have to say like i loved the whole way they kind of introduced um palatinus equinox in the game the latest uh, you know like um chapter that we had i think one day ago and the whole part with where um, Bianca kind of goes in the stigmata space, you know, like I played it recently. Um, stigmata plays and gets to know the secret of her, who she is, who Kiana is, this and that. You know, that 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 part fascinated me so much. I thought about like you know watching this and reacting to this like you know little trailer. It's a very short video. 2 minutes 16 seconds it won't take much long so let's just watch this and see you know what what amazing stuff uh, you know <laughs> honkai bing has brought us this time and uh, i'll talk about my impressions after reacting to this video uh, so yeah let's get started the link to the original video is in my description box obviously you guys must have watched it if you haven't click on it and check uh, the original video out as well so let's get started um this is honkai impact third S rank battlesuit Palatinus Equinox trailer forever stay true to yourself. So here we go. Start. Okay. Alright. Wooden chime. No, not wooden chime. Glass chime. Oh. Oh my god, look, okay. There she is. Oh, look at that. <laughs> oh my god, so... Oh my god, oh my god. Kiana, so This is like you. Oh my god, uh, this is so cute. Uh, just look at a small Bianca. Oh my god. <笑><笑> <laughs> oh my god oh my god this oh my god this trailer That was diabetes inducing. My God. Oh my God, look at this. Great, um, yeah. This was Mihoyo's attempt to kill us with cuteness. So, <laughs> good job, you almost, almost did that. You almost ac accomplished that. What? Oh my god! <laughs> I I have to I I have to say I think this was like the the most cutest trailer I have ever seen in Honkai Impact. Wow. Okay. <laughs> Fantastic. My god. Okay. I was I was not expecting some something <laughs> like this. great okay yeah this is probably my most favorite trailer i have to say like i i i don't have anything else to like you know explain how great this was like it's so nice to see you know like normalcy 
in Hong Kai Impact. You know, like this is like a normal scene of a family just there, you know, doing normal stuff, normal everyday stuff. Uh, you know, like the dad just uh, reading a storybook to her, uh, you know, to her daughter. Uh, the mom also like, you know, making, like you know, kind of taking care of her and just, you know, normal things and the kid just having fun. And just with kind of, uh, what can I say, uh, kind of acting like a superhero with the little um, umbrella in her hand, saying that, oh, this is the abyss flower, I'm going to take down <laughs> the bad guys. And yeah, that was just it. And it's like, and I have to say, I think I never thought that Bianca would actually look like that. Like, obviously looked like this when she was a child, because she looked completely like Kiana, completely. Like... I do know, like, you know, like, Kiana is, uh, my, is Bianca's clone, uh, and I always thought, like, how can, like, you know, they, they don't look, like, that kind of looks the same, but at the same time, they don't. Now that I'm seeing uh, how she, how Bianca looked like when she was a child, yeah, I, I can probably understand, like, you know, that, yeah, Kiana and Bianca, they are clones. Uh, they are sorry not they are clones sorry kiana is bianca's clone so it makes a lot more sense and obviously i'm calling kiana kiana because i know like the original kiana is bianca but i i don't remember the code name k234 is that the code name of kiana i forgot i i always forget that code name so that's why i'm calling her kiana you know i'm not calling her with that name because i don't remember it so yeah anyways all right oh my god such a great uh, you know trailer Mm. We like, and I always loved whenever, like, you know, Honkai kind of brought in, Ce uh, like, you know, Cecilia and Siegfried. Uh, and I just love, like, you know, kind of uh, seeing portions that had her, uh, her and uh, Siegfried. So, like, you know, seeing this, you know, like, trailer with both Siegfried, Kiana, um, or Bianca, and um, Cecilia in it, it's, it's just so amazing. And <laughs> little Bianca is the most cutest, like, you know. <laughs> child i've ever seen like wow i was not expecting that like they they really like animated this so well and that scene of B uh, bianca holding the umbrella and sh she's like abyss flower let's save the world again and just holding the umbrella <laughs> that that was that was cute and uh, oh boy i can't wait for this part to come in the game <laughs> And obviously, like, you know, she was kind of holding the umbrella towards the older, grown-up Bianca. And yeah. Now, here's one thing that I uh, realized after watching this again. Uh, I did not realize this before, but uh, Bianca's, um, uh, the form, uh, Palatinus Equinox, one of the part of her hair is kind of white. The way she kind of looked like when she was younger you know like completely white uh, her hair and the, the rest of it is uh, yellowish now here's some, another thing why did her hair become yellow this is one thing that i don't know like she sh her hair color her natural hair color is white isn't it so shouldn't it remain white how did it become yellow i don't know that i'm i'm not even sure if they actually mentioned the reason but yeah like that's now that i can I, i'm watching that scene again i can see like there's like one lock of hair you know which is like whitish and the others are just yellow so yeah this kind of shows us like who would have thought you know who would have thought bianca would actually turn out to be the original kiana like i never saw this coming like this this just came out of the blue like i was really not expecting something like that and now that I think about it, yeah, there have been little bits and pieces of hints, like how they kind of always, like, you know, uh, showcase both Kiana and um, Bianca together, which kind of, like, you know, now that I'm, like, you know, watching this, I can realize that why they did that, because both are kind of sisters. And that's why they always, like, you know, showcase both of them together and kind of, like, you know, drew a parallel between Kiana and Bianca, always. Bianca is the strongest s rank Valkyrie. Kiana wanted, always wanted to become the s rank strongest s rank Valkyrie. And it makes so much sense now because Kiana is actually Bianca's clone. Like, you know, both of their dreams were the same. 
and you know like so, so amazing like i just i just loved the the way they kind of like you know introduced this whole thing and i i recently played the last latest chapter and it was fantastic it was a long chapter you know like i remember i like it, it was like two more than two hours three hours or something like i was just sitting there and playing and it was so great the way they little by little kind of like you know made us realize that yeah bianca is kiana the original kiana fantastic they could have just ended it with one uh, like you know one uh, statement but no they actually like you know little by little made us go through that stigmata space and little by little like you know they kind of made us realize that oh bianca something is going on with her she, she must be kiana made us realize and then they told us that yeah this is the truth like really well done like great storytelling i've, I've always loved honkai's uh, way of storytelling it's fantastic you know like um i and i i like you know i i have to say it's probably one of the best storytellings i have read honkai's storytelling like it's so amazing the, the first few chapters were okay but it started getting better from um i'm sure you guys know which chapter uh himeko's death from there onwards it became better and better and it's, it's now it's fantastic i just love it so much so yeah now her latest battle suit battle uh palatinus equinox um we played like you know we got a little trailer of it and we also played it in the latest chapter it's fantastic you know i have to say um she has a horse with her which is called krishna now here's a funny thing um krishna is actually um uh, the name of a god in like you know in india not only in india in hindu mythology sorry um <clears throat> it's like uh krishna is the one of the uh, avatars of lord vishnu so um I've, I've seen this before as well like a lot of honkai's characters have like uh you know names from the hindu mythology for example parvati um ganesha uh like krishna we can see this now uh what else kumbhakarna again part of hindu mythology um like these like i don't know like you know oh and uh, i think uh the whole thing with the void archives the man manga as well it had something written in like hindi language so this is like a thing between like you know hindu mythology and indian you know mythology with uh honkai but i never I, I don't know why they kind of like you know like mix that but it's great i, I, I like it like you know whenever like i see some you know some game or whatever like mixing in hindu mythology the place where from where i was i am born india stuff like that when they kind of mix it in different things i always enjoy it you know it's kind of like nice to see <laughs> so like as soon as i got to know like this like horse's name is krishna i was like wow <laughs> so i don't know if there's like a greater bigger meaning behind that why behind the me uh, like you know names or something but yeah like i'm <laughs> i'm pretty hyped to get this character um i think she's going to come out by the end of february hopefully by that time i'll have enough crystals to roll for her so i'm currently at 50 pity so i hopefully will be able to get her um, quite soon i might not be able to get her gears but at least i'll get the battle suit <laughs> so yeah anyways that was it that was my reaction to this trailer uh forever stay true to yourself honkai impact third s rank battle suit palatinus equinox trailer so if you guys enjoyed this video be sure to press the like button subscribe if you're new to the channel or you haven't subscribed and comment down below anything you want to say anything you want to let me know and i'll check them out how you liked the latest chapter all that stuff let me know i always love talking about honkai impact <laughs> so yeah that's it thank you guys for watching i'll see you guys in the next video so until then goodbye and have a nice day